the young and the restless spoilers. A clash of ambitions, the tumultuous relationship between Kyle and Diane. In the bustling city of Genoa, where power dynamics and corporate maneuvering often overshadow personal relationships, a poignant and intense confrontation unfolded between Kyle Abbott and his mother, Diane Jenkins. Their meeting was not a harmonious reunion but rather a heated exchange filled with accusations and revelations that threatened to sever their already fragile bond. Diane, harboring resentment, confronted Kyle with a sharp accusation, he was the reason behind her dismissal by Jack Abbott, the patriarch of the Abbott family and CEO of Chabot Cosmetics. Her eyes blazed with anger as she declared that their relationship as mother and son was over, irrevocably damaged by Kyle's actions. The bitterness in her voice was palpable, as if the very foundation of their familial ties was crumbling beneath the weight of betrayal. Kyle, however, had his own truths to reveal. He stood firm, countering his mother's accusations with a stark and humiliating truth that left Diane momentarily speechless. He accused her of being selfish and greedy, never taking into account his desires and aspirations. Kyle's voice trembled with the frustration of years of feeling unheard and undervalued. He reminded Diane of how her relentless ambition and refusal to listen had driven him away from the family, leaving a trail of anger and disappointment in its wake. Diane's ambition had always been a double-edged sword. Her drive to secure the position of CEO at Chabot had blinded her to the needs and wishes of her own son. When Kyle had expressed a desire to learn from her and become a co-CEO, hoping to gain valuable experience and guidance, Diane had cruelly rebuffed him. Her harsh words and dismissive attitude had only deepened the chasm between them. It was a bitter irony that Diane, who once yearned for familial bonds, had allowed her quest for power to eclipse her role as a mother. Since her return to Genoa, Diane's singular focus had been on securing the CEO position at Chabot. She saw it as her rightful place, a symbol of her success and a testament to her capabilities. Yet, in her relentless pursuit, she had neglected the most important aspect of her life, her relationship with her son. The realization that she had allowed ambition to overshadow love and family began to dawn on her. Diane's epiphany was as profound as it was painful. For the first time, she recognized that genuine affection and understanding were far more valuable than any corporate title or power play. The harsh truth delivered by Kyle acted as a catalyst for this realization. It was a wake-up call that pierced through the layers of ambition and ego, revealing the hollow core of her aspirations. But the question remained. How would Diane rectify her mistakes? Could she mend the broken relationship with her son and regain his trust and forgiveness? The road to redemption was fraught with challenges, and Diane knew it would require more than mere words to heal the wounds she had inflicted. Diane's journey towards reconciliation began with a sincere acknowledgement of her faults. She had to confront the reality that she had placed her ambitions above her son's needs and desires. This self-awareness was the first step in her path to redemption. Diane resolved to change her ways, to become a mother who listened, cared, and supported her son's aspirations without imposing her own ambitions on him. Kyle's words had not only awakened Diane but had also sparked hope within the Abbott family. The possibility of reconciliation and unity seemed within reach, but it required Diane to demonstrate her commitment to change through actions, not just words. She needed to show Kyle that she valued their relationship above all else and was willing to make amends. Diane's efforts to bridge the gap between her and Kyle began with small, sincere gestures. She started by genuinely listening to him, understanding his dreams and aspirations, and offering her support. Diane also made a conscious decision to step back from her aggressive pursuit of the CEO position, recognizing that true fulfillment came from nurturing meaningful relationships rather than achieving corporate success. As Diane worked to rebuild her relationship with Kyle, the Abbott family watched with cautious optimism. The wounds of the past were deep, but the prospect of healing and unity offered a glimmer of hope. Diane's transformation from a power-driven executive to a compassionate mother was not instantaneous, but her consistent efforts began to chip away at the barriers that had separated her from her son. The road to forgiveness was long and arduous, but Kyle began to see the sincerity in his mother's actions. Her willingness to change, to prioritize their relationship, and to support his aspirations gradually softened his heart.